thank you so much for being with us to join in this very happy occasion to mark the beginning of the next phase of Natasha's and Jake's lives together. A few years ago, I came down to visit Jake, as I often do, and we spent the whole day together, and I was just about to get the train back home, and he said, well, um, shall we just pop in here before you go back? And we just, well, I said, okay. We walked into a pub, and inside that pub was a very attractive young lady who was introduced to me as Natasha. And I was like, mate, you've been keeping this one quiet. We've been together the whole day. You think you might have mentioned this? Now, if I'd met some kind of knockout girl like this, I'd be telling everyone. But anyway, it soon became clear that they were a very good fit. I spoke to all of the South End friends. Uh, we all agreed that Natasha was the very best thing to happen to Jay for an extremely long time. <laughs> I was once asked by a music magazine, had I ever met any really hot groupies? My answer at the time was, if I'd met a beautiful groupie, she wouldn't be called a groupie. She'd be called a wife. So after decades of searching and a lot of growing up to do, I have finally met the ultimate groupie. We have come together in the presence of God to give thanks with Natasha and Jake for their married life, to rejoice together and to ask for God's blessing. I, Jake, took you, Natasha, to be my wife. I, Natasha, took you, Jake, to be my husband. To have and to hold from that day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, till death us do us part, according to God's holy law. And this was our solemn vow. Today, in the presence of our family and friends, we affirm our continuing commitment to this vow. When we first got together, Natasha kindly said, this is a true story, she said I was the smartest man she had ever met. Last week, during hectic last minute wedding preparations, she said I was the stupidest man she'd ever met. <laughs> Which I think typifies how this wonderful lady plans to keep me on my toes. a little bit jealous of people who describe their partners as their best friends. Well, now I know what it truly means. I genuinely enjoy spending every minute of my life with Natasha, and I cherish every moment with her dearly. She is a brilliant businesswoman, a great communicator, a fearsome competitor, and has the largest collection of vintage My Little Ponies <laughs> south of the South Downs.
please join me in raising a toast to Jake and Natasha. Your tiger feet. Your tiger feet.